All right, hi everyone. Welcome to installment two in our series here on RoadBikeReview.com on power meters. So today we're going to talk about the Cyclops Power Tap system. Uh, the first installment we talked about the SRM, and we talked about the fact that the SRM determines power by measuring torque and rotational velocity uh, at the crank set. The power tap system functions on uh, the same fundamental type of measurement. It measures torque and rotational velocity, but it does so back here actually in the hub unit. Um, what we're showing today is uh, the wireless system that we have set up on this bike, which is a really nice clean system. Um, we'll give you some close-up shots there in a minute, but you'll notice there are no wires anywhere in this installation. All the data gets transmitted directly from the hub unit to the head unit, which we have mounted on the stem. So back here in the rear hub, there's actually uh, a thing called a torque tube. It's got strain gauges on it. It measures how much torque uh, is being applied, and then it calculates the rotation, that and the rotational velocity to determine power. Um, this hub unit also actually will determine your cadence. Uh, so uh, it looks at the fluctuations in power levels, and it actually measures the cadence. Um, Cyclops also makes a standalone speed cadence sensor that you can put on the chain stay to get a little bit more reliable reading on the cadence as well using just a standard magnet on, on your crank set. But, uh, but you can go with just everything coming directly off the, the hub on the wireless system. Uh, pricing on the power tab system starts at $1,000 for the wired system and that includes a fully built rear wheel uh, with a Mavic rim all the way up to $1,600 for the wireless unit. Um, that we're showing here today. That includes the Power Agent software as well that you can use to download your power data and analyze your ride files uh, and use that to make your training more efficient and, and measure your progress. Uh, one thing I also really like about the PowerTap system, um, it's of course very flexible. You can move it between bikes pretty easily. Uh, they now have a, uh, a mountain bike version out, so you can use the same head unit, buy another wheel for your mountain bike, measure for off-road, uh, which is pretty exciting. Um, you can also actually buy just the head unit as a standalone uh, cycle computer heart rate monitor using the wireless uh, speed or cadence transmitter. So it's about a $320 purchase, but it gives you the ability to make an incremental investment and then upgrade later uh, with the PowerTap hub if that's how you want to go. So it kind of gets you started with measuring your ride data in a downloadable format uh, and then make an incremental investment uh, to upgrade to power at a later time.